August 8th, the Feast of the Fourteen Holy Helpers. This name represents a group of saints, devotion to whom as a body was German in origin and largely German in diffusion. The idea behind the devotion is sufficiently indicated by its name, and the theoretical qualification for inclusion in the group was a divine promise to the saint during life that he or she would have a particular intercessionary power to help men in need. These saints have been invoked as a group ever since the time of an endemic which devastated Europe from the year 1346 to 1349. It was called the Plague or Black Death. Some of its terrible symptoms were turning black of the tongue, a parched throat, violent headaches, fever, and sores on the abdomen. This dreadful disease attacked its victims suddenly, depriving them of their use of reason and causing death in a few hours. Many died in this horrible way without even the benefit of the last sacraments. All natural cures for the plague were fruitless. During this period of widespread agony, the people turned toward heaven with confidence. They took refuge in the intercession of the saints, praying to be spared of the plague's deadly attack or to be cured when stricken. The usual fourteen names are Saint Acacius, invoked against headaches and in death's agony. Barbara, invoked against fear, lightning, fire, explosion, and sudden and unprepared death. St. Blaise, invoked against throat troubles. St. Catherine, invoked by philosophers, students, and for ills of the tongue. St. Christopher, invoked by travelers in difficulties and the bubonic plague. Syriacus is powerful in protection against temptation, especially those at the hour of death and also of diseases of the eye. Dennis, invoked against demonic possession, headache, and rabies. Ursmus against colic and cramps. Eustace, invoked by hunters, family discord, and against fire. St. George, protector of soldiers and herpetic diseases. St. Giles, invoked against epilepsy, insanity, and sterility, and the grace to make a good confession. St. Margaret, invoked against possession and by pregnant women. St. Pantaleon, invoked against cancer tuberculosis, and is the patron saint of doctors. St. Vitus, invoked against epilepsy and his dance. St. Eustace is a patron in all kind of difficulties, including protection against fire. Also, since he was separated from his family because of unusual painful circumstances, St. Eustace is also invoked in family troubles. During the Black Death, his patronage was especially invoked since many families were suffering attacks and separation due to the widespread terror and death. Saints Blaise, George, Ursmus, Pantaleon, and Vitus are also invoked for the protection of domestic animals, which were also attacked by the plague. In France, the helpers are 15, the extra one being Our Lady. The following of this feast became widely diffused during the 15th century. It spread from the Germanies to Bohemia, Moravia, Hungary, Italy, and France. It does not seem to have reached England. Churches, hospitals, and shrines were named after the Holy Helpers, and their feast was permitted in various places, on August 8th and other dates. Whenever and wherever these saints have been invoked, they have proven themselves to be eager helpers. More than anything else, this saintly band desires to intercede for those who confidently and faithfully call upon them in all difficulties and trials, however serious or sudden these troubles may be.